Well, people peeved over this trash pickup, or should I say, a lack thereof. Residents calling the 19 troubleshooters after waiting now six weeks for their garbage to be picked up. Michelle Nix live tonight working to get some answers for these frustrated people. Michelle. Good evening, Chris. Well, imagine looking out of your front window and this is what you see. Trash piled up everywhere. That's the reality for the residents here at Westgate Garden Apartments in Lorraine. Now, they tell me it's been this way for at least six weeks. It's piled up well over six feet high. There's at least six dumpsters here. And a councilman tells me he was promised that the bill was paid to the people who dispose of the trash, but even they won't dispose of it when it's piled up like this. When I pulled up, I, I mean, I could literally smell it. But Thanksgiving just passed, so this food is just sitting and sitting there. And yeah, like my mom said, it's a, it's a health, it's a health issue. Trash bins piled so high and overflowing, they can't be emptied the way they are. Stinky garbage of food and diapers that's now all over the ground at the Westgate Garden Apartments on Levitt Road in Lorraine. Maria Baez has lived here 20 years and says she's not getting what her rent is supposed to pay for. It is ridiculous. Um, this has been like third time, but this is the worst. Lorraine City Councilman Ray Carrion doesn't even represent the seventh ward, but he says he represents people, and he says that's what this apartment complex should be doing. I am I'm beyond fed up. Uh, I just think this is abuse. Uh, this is uh, corporations. Uh, taken advantage. Councilman Carrion not only talked to the management here three weeks ago, he came out to these dumpsters on Thanksgiving with volunteers to clean up the overflow of garbage here and at Pearl Village Apartments, but says the management here has given him and the residents nothing but broken promises. Myself and through our foundation, we brought in, and, and volunteers uh, brought in dumpsters at two locations and, and paid workers to clean things up because it was a mess with the hope and understanding that those uh, pickups will be restored rather quickly, uh, and they haven't. I reached out to the management at Westgate and Pearl Village, but it was after hours and I was forced to leave a message. But this document from the Secretary of State is supposed to show a change in ownership, but the company names are almost identical, WG Westgate Gardens and LLC. That we're not going to put up with this. We are not going to tolerate this type of uh, business practice. Uh, it violates every provision of the of the tenant landlord law that's stated in, in in the state of Ohio. Now, residents tell me while trash is the obvious problem here, there are also other concerns. Some residents don't have heat, they tell me, and they're also not getting mail delivery because of broken mailboxes. Councilman Carrion is working to find out how quickly he can get this mess cleaned up. 19 News troubleshooters working to get answers for the residents here and find out when this mess will be cleaned up. Reporting live in Lorraine, Michelle Nix, 19 News.